Oh Gott. What is happening here? Does it pause? Okay. Ah. Oh. Run, 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 run. Is it dead? Jesus. Yes, we did it. Jesus, that was tough. My heart's racing. <laughs> it takes a, a bit. Like, they're quite tough. How's my health? Fine. So we don't need to heal. And more than this, I can't really see. <sighs> okay. We did it. That's good. This was... Uh, forgot about it. Locked from the other side. Yep. Okay, so I would suggest that we now go back upstairs. Because upstairs there were quite a few rooms that we couldn't access. Did anything change here? Okay, I can't walk. Ah. So I shouldn't go into the dark without the lighter on. I can't walk when I'm holding up my crowbar or the nail gun. I really wonder what that is. We find the clues for this. It's also locked from the other side. Okay, so this is accessible now. This is where we can save, but we can't save because we don't. I hate this. I can't see it. Fuck! Was effective. Okay, I have no p no chance to get to there. Oh, I wish I could save. Okay, let's go to the maternity ward. Maybe we find something there. But I doubt that we find possibilities to save that quickly. A photo of a nurse standing next to a patient. Yeah. <sighs> Lucas Houston evening shift electrical maintenance 1445. The nurses told me that a lamp was malfunctioning in the maternity ward. When I turned on the lights, I could see that one of the bulbs in the wall was indeed flickering. 
As I was getting ready to change it, a man came out of nowhere and grabbed me by the shoulders, pushing me back with strength unimaginably, unimaginable for someone his age. He told me not to touch it. I didn't want to argue with him, so I simply left. I can't stop thinking about him. Why did he, why did the old man prevent me from touching it? I should check it out. And I think this is what we picked up. Yeah, the generator room. Uh. No. It's full of various medicines. Well then, open it. Grab some for you. Not too shy, son. Ah, this is the guy. Clenched from rigor mortis. switched off. Oh, comforting. Huh. says nothing happens. His chest was left open in the middle of a procedure. The heart is missing. Okay, so it seems like he doesn't... Okay, maybe he doesn't need the left side but the right side. Why did the, the thing open? Where did the hatch go here? Oh no, I don't want to go down. <laughs> <gasps> yes! Oh, yes! Oh, please, that's amazing. with this camera. There is mannequins I kept under these sheets. Awesome. Oh God, the music makes me... Oh, what's happening? Resources. Use. You could. Li yeah, I know. I used it. Okay. Oh! <gasps> Dog. Why? Oh no. Are you nuts? Oh, 
Lovely. Get back in there. Oh my god, I'm sorry, my <laughs> my my dog just oh god came into the room and scared me. Oh Jesus. Oh my Oh no. Ah! I'm already in a critical move. Ach nee. Okay, hold on. Need to heal. And I wanna use... Okay, oh, do you know how much we have to do now? Oh no! Oh, fuck. That is punishing. Oh shit. What is that? What does mean continue? Probably the same with load game, since we only have one slot. Yeah. Oh, So, the, yeah, the next time we find the tape, we're gonna save before we go through the mirror. Because we're not gonna do all of this again. Why are all I think I can't any that oh, thank you. First time we fought this um, half person wasn't too bad, but what really gets me is, or what's really effective is the um, stuff that he's spitting. <sighs> okay, thank God we know all of this. can be done relatively quickly.
power on. We're gonna equip this. And thumbs press that it's working as well as it um, worked the uh, time before. Ah, no, 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 no. Oh, fuck me. I'm not sure how much I have left. Let's quickly grab this gun. Do I hit him? Yeah. Oh, well, that was better. And I'm fine. Okay, so now... Let's equip the... Um, crowbar again because even though I don't have to okay let's let's go in here first read this. This is something where we couldn't do anything. Um, and there, yeah, okay, here this was something that we can still pick up. And then we move the lamp. And then we go down. And I think this is when we picked up the The tape, we grab the tape, we go back up, we save, and then we don't have to do this stuff again. I think that's the, the best solution. of you in a second. I don't know if it resets their health as well if I'm leaving. I could imagine that. Oh, damn it. Oh, what? Did I just reload? <gasps> awesome. I. Oh, cool. Is that dead? 
take this one still. I need to go because otherwise it's gonna spit at me. I need to go, I need to walk further to get him. Okay, I need to do this. I need to walk further into the room. Wow, do they respawn there? I hope not. Um. Oh. Okay, let me get past. Come with me. I hope that they're not there all the time. And why did this one move? It was here before. It was sitting there. It should. It moved. So, I'm gonna save. And I wonder if... What happens if I... When I come out of the room again. Jesus. Uh, no, it's here. Let's use another slot. How much nails do I have left? Zero. Cool. So they stay down, that's good. I would like to swap to the crowbar though. Why didn't you hit him? That's a huge leg. But thankfully we just saved, that's fine. Oh, now the question is which one does it use? If it uses the first one, then we need to load games. I know what to expect now. That's a good thing. I might healing too much, I don't know. Where is it?
Okay, that's a big question mark to me. Why did I die there? definitely need to heal because otherwise I'm gonna die immediately. This is quite annoying. I'm gonna use them. Use up those two um, nails, and then I switch to the crowbar because I my hope is that the nail gun is doing a little bit more damage, and so therefore I don't have to hit it too often with the crowbar anymore. Because that is just difficult.
Oh. Dämliches Ding. Unbelievable. Yeah, this is something we really need, I think. Yep. Why was he so difficult? Okay, so the water is switched off. These surgical tools don't appear to be in a good condition. X-ray images help. Okay. Yes, nice. Medical books, nothing useful. And then we have this. September 17th, 1941. As I crept quietly behind my father, the clock struck 1.30 a.m. I saw him enter the mausoleum after placing three elements on some kind of board. He went through quietly. I followed him ah, I followed him at the distance, trying not to make a sound, for I did not want to be caught. At mother's tomb, my father sank to his knees and rested his hands on the cold, sculpted marble figure of his wife. He began praying. I felt guilty following him. Seeing the cold and calculating man this way moved me. I was about to leave my f I was about to leave when father stood up and approached the angel statue. Mother's marble tomb moved slowly to the side and exposed a narrow staircase leading into darkness. He climbed down the stairs. I hesitated for a moment, my legs not wanting to take another step, but was able to stand and follow him down. Once inside, I heard metallic sounds and the echo of running water. A few moments later, I bumped into a ladder. I climbed down and found myself in a long stone tunnel covered in pipes and sewage. I saw Father's silhouette turning a corner and hurried, hurriedly followed. Before me appeared a huge metallic door and a group of men wearing strange suits like those worn to protect from radioactivity. Each carried a giant hammer. My father joined the group and they received him by hitting their hammers together. A hospital bed on each side of the group carried what appeared to be bodies covered in sheets. My father put on one of the disturbing suits. In my frightened stupor, I loosened a brick from the wall. I sma it smashed against the floor with the sound of a thousand buildings crashing down. I could feel their eyes turn to me as I fled back the way I had come. Their guttural voices screaming to catch me while they hit the hammers on the ground. Jesus. Still out of order. 